it's uh, no hidden fact that the American public is very frustrated, angry, and it's been evidenced all the way through the campaigns. And that's the reason behind a record voter turnout this year in Louisiana, according to the Secretary of State. Tom Shedler says early voting in the Pelican State reached a record of 515,000, surpassing the previous record of 356,000. And despite Tuesday's rainy weather, Shedler believes more people will still make it to the polls, giving Louisiana a roughly 70 percent voter turnout this year. Let's face it, Louisianians are used to rain, uh, put on those galoshes, shrimp boots, whatever you want to call them, and, and rain hoods and, and get out and vote. In addition to the hotly contested presidential race, there's also a showdown for a Senate seat. 24 people on the ballot vying for David Vitter's former post, and it's a matchup that Shedler says won't likely end on Tuesday. When you have that many people in a race, a very slim margin of votes could make the difference of someone getting into the runoff or not. And with many of these races down to the wire this year, you can get those results as soon as the Secretary of State's office gets them through the Go Vote app. It's live as those numbers make their way to Baton Rouge. Shedler is still encouraging people to be a part of that number. And even if the election has you discouraged, he says know that in this election, one vote could be that deciding factor. So I know a lot of people don't feel that, but but I can assure the voters out there that every vote counts. Reporting from New Orleans, I'm Randy Russo, WDSU News.